Hey guys, I'm, I usually have light in my room today, but I'm using a backup power source because power went out uh, all over the, my town. And, but, you know, I have backup power source. I have uh, my computer working. Hell yeah. And I was like, what a cool idea to post a video during this. And I'm going to show you how you get WinWar and how it, you can make it work. It's really simple. I uh, I'm gonna show you how to do it. I'm gonna post the link to this site in my um description of this video. Uh ww dot rar rar I mean rar if you can hear me. R A R Lab L A B dot com and um you wanna go to downloads. Uh, right up top, it'd be WinRAR 3.71. Want to click save. This is um, you want to save to it as an application. It doesn't matter because it said pop up like that, anyways. <coughs> okay, let me see it one second. What is this? Nah, back that out. This is what's gonna, wait, This is what you're gonna have. Where is it? Right here. Drag this over here to hit this guy's chest. No, oh, look, I think I can steady up my camera one second. This is to say W R A R 371. Click on it. I'm going to click run. Since I have Vista, this always pops up. It's like allow, like safety protection, whatever. Safe from AIDS. You're gonna look for this. You can scroll through it if you want, but uh, I'm not a kind of guy who reads. Got all this. That's what you're gonna need. Don't don't touch anything. Just keep it as it is. You want to click OK. Um, what is it? Click OK again. The devil's water ain't so bad. You don't have to drink right now. You'll need to provide permission to move this file. Process RAR. Zip another file. Continue. Continue. Listen, um, you might not get the same thing that I did. You might not get this pop-up window. But if you did, you want to take the thing that says WinRAR and drag it to your desktop. And uh, just ignore the, the windows that pop up. But here you go. This is WinRAR. It's very easy. You know, this is to access some files. I'm going to show you how you use it now. Here we go. We're going to click on WinRAR. I already had this. I just started, deleted everything, which was stupid of me. But it's a new version. It looks better. Alright, I'm going to go back to the beginning. This is from my desktop. Uh, I, I, let me see if I can remember what, how to get here. Oh, look, it's highlighted. Huh. Okay. When you access it, this might pop up. You might have... Um, I think I should zoom in for this. Local disk. And all this stuff, you might, you might not. It should just say just computer right here. And if it doesn't, just click computer and then, then basically just wait. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. It doesn't work. You want to click local disk. Scroll down until you see users. You, users right here. You're going to need that. It's either, it would say owner, which would be you. Well, it depends if you have your own computer, then you'll be owner. Um, or whatever your name is, then that would be you. Since I'm the owner, I want to click this. Um, see, so then it'll bring you to this site. You're going to click desktop, and it'll bring you to your desktop. Now, a file that I'm going to give to you in a later video, in the next video that I will, you know, I'm gonna, it's about GBA files again, because I already have one, but people are always, I get the messages saying that doesn't, I mean, I can't wait or whatever because of the fucking 
they shut it down and shit. So I'm just gonna show you how I did mine. And you're gonna need this for that. And you get it every time you know you get exit it and every time you open it it'll be to that. And you're gonna need that. Now save that to your desktop and I'm gonna show you how to get cute FTP Pro and later on. Peace.